In this video, I'll show you how to set up two-factor authentication on CoinSpot. Two-factor authentication adds an extra layer of security to your CoinSpot account. So, here's how you can enable it using Google Authentificator. Firstly, click on the Enable 2FA option after you log into your CoinSpot account. This will take you to the two-factor authentication section. Click on Enable it again on this page. If you don't have it installed, download it from the App Store or Google Play Store if you have an Android. Now, tap on Add Account and then choose Scan Barcode option. Point your phone's camera at the QR code on your computer screen to scan it. Now, Enter the six-digit code generated by Google Authenticator. This code changes every 15 seconds, so make sure to type it quickly in the token bar on your CoinSpot account. Then click on Submit to verify the code. All you have to do now is log out of your CoinSpot account and log back in. And after entering your password, you will be prompt to enter the 2FA code. Just to check, you have to log in. Uh, of course, sorry. You have to log out then log back in to verify that the 2FA is activated. Just open also Google Authenticator, enter the new 6-digit code and click Submit. Now, take a screenshot of your QR code and the 32-character code. Because before scanning the QR code, capture a screenshot or note down the 32-character code displayed in the CoinSpot page because this is crucial in the case you lost access to your phone or the Google Authenticator app malfunctions. Now, let's save the screenshot. On a Windows computer, use the snipping tool to capture the screenshot. Go to the Start menu and type in Snipping Tool. Choose Rectangular Snip and save the screenshot to a secure location you will remember later, because this is a crucial, because... Also, once a malfunction, as I said, happened to the Google Authenticator or the CoinSpot application, you will find it there. Also, ensure you save the code somewhere safe because you'll need it to your phone. You'll need it if your phone is lost or reset. Just remember, the more layers of security you have, the less likely hackers can access your account. Always keep your backup code safe. And if you find this guide helpful, please share and subscribe.